hey what's going on guys in this video we will have a quick benchmark test of brand new asus Enphone 2 laser this model which is powered by qualcomm 410 64-bit processor with 2gb ram and we are going to perform a test and to benchmark test on this device i already conducted a test and i found a result of 21,000 something now we are going to test again and see the result this time I am going to perform a 64-bit processor performance here I got a score of 21,850 before but I am going to uh, do a test again to show you what will be the result after making some changes so the the test is going on actually this ben benchmark scores uh, represent the phone performance but we cannot uh, judge it by day-to-day -day performance of this phone some of the phones which scored above 40,000 uh, which is not performing well if we are concerned about the Wi-Fi network and all those things and also the performance of the phone depends on the temperature uh, which arised uh, due to the continu continuous usage of the phone so these are all depend on the performance uh, of the processor as well as the RAM and the type of applications which we are using most of the applications we are using on this phone are 32 bit uh, transfer rate uh, but uh, this CPU which is 64 bit processor if we need to get the 64 bit processor performance we need to have the applications which are made of made uh, made of a 64-bit architecture so here we are using the applications as 32-bit processing for the processor so we can we will not get the full performance of the CPU anyway however we are going to we are performing the test on a 64-bit and to benchmark tester so we will get the result which we want it will take some time to perform this uh, benchmark test we can also conduct uh, some other benchmark test on uh, some other applications but these are synthetic scores which will not guarantee that the handset will perform well uh, regarding uh, with these results however this as you send phone 2 which will have a decent specification which is having a decent specification which will give as a decent score that I hope this one is having a HD display not a full HD display and also a removable battery so that in case of any trouble with the battery we can remove it and we can also replace the battery this is a volume rock button and 13 megapixel camera equipped with the LED and the laser autofocus. You can see the frames here. Actually, these scores are mainly uh, deal with the perform, not the performance of the phone, but if we are playing games on this device we can see that the frames are dropping in case the device is not performing well also the phone get heated up but here I am not feeling that uh, heat on my device a slight warm is there on my hand but it, it is not heating much now we conducted the test and uh, here is our score 23,425 earlier it was slow but now I'm getting greater score than the earlier score so that's it this video shows you the benchmark result of Android 2 benchmark uh, we conducted on a, our as you sent phone 2 so these are the other scores of various devices and considering these devices our devices device score is low but the thing is that these are all synthetic scores 
which will not affect the performance of the phone the performance of the phone depends on our usage and the type of applications we are dealing with so thank you for watching this video if you have any questions you can pause below